My name's Ali. I'm a co-founder of Chocolate Tree. We always loved chocolate since we were kids. That's me and my wife, Frederica, who's uh, the other um, partner in all this mischief. We never started with the mind that we would like create a, a business as such. We were just having fun. We were traveling around music festivals with a solar powered organic geodesic dome tent cafe that we built, you know. Although we've been going for 10 years, I'd say it's only really taken off in the past four or five years because we've been focusing on growth and seeing the benefits and the reasons why we should uh, become a slightly bigger business and the more, with the more impact we can have in a positive way on the local economy, but also much bigger, far reaching implications for people in the countries where cocoa comes from. We went to Madagascar in November 2015 and met with the, the supplier uh, there. It was a really interesting experience. And Madagascar is the poorest country in the world right now that's not in conflict. But it's good to see how a crop like cocoa can really encourage biodiversity um, in a commercial way and maintain um, the, the lands in a positive way. It's agriculture, but it's also affecting the economy and that impacts the people. We're going back there soon to a very remote part of the foothills of the Andes where a special cocoa is growing. The genetics are really interesting and there's a project there to process those to a really high standard, which means that we can make really good chocolate. Yeah, I've been to Colombia and uh, Ecuador and Peru as well. The challenges involved have been massive because we don't have a lot of money and we don't have we've had to learn a lot of skills. Um, there's been all kinds of challenges, like from managing people and learning how to do that to managing finance, managing cash flow. I mean, yeah, it's, it's pretty tough, but uh, we love it, you know, and if you're passionate about something, then you'll, you'll work through all those challenges to, to make it work because you just, you know, I mean, I love Monday mornings. You know, I get up and I'm like, right, let's go to work. We've got two kids, so the weekends are pretty much off limits for work. Um, but yeah, I mean, we're really excited about what we do and basically work in a chocolate factory <laughs> and travel the world. You know, that's, that's what we dream about. And that's what we're doing. And I think that everybody should chase their dreams.